we begin the data loading process by going to Manage Databases and defining the SQL Data Warehouse details. Next, I define the Trinity CloudBeam VM image details. And finally, I specify the Azure Blob storage details. In this demo, I'm using an on-premise SQL database as my source. Now I'll create a new task to begin the data loading process. In the interface, I drag my SQL server source and my SQL data warehouse target into the task settings. Now I'll use the table selection tool to select from my source schema the list of tables I want to replicate. Finally, in my task settings, I define the schema name for my target metadata. Now I'll save the task and run it. The full load process handles the data loading into the target tables. Once the full load process is completed, the task automatically switches into change data capture mode. Let's make some changes to the source. Here, I'll insert some new records and make an update to the color of some of the products. Switching back to the Trinity console, we now see that the inserts have been completed, and after a few seconds, the updates are also applied to the target. A quick query on the target SQL data warehouse shows the applied changes. Thank you.